Welcome, folks, to another edition of Tiffin Cast. I'm your host, Seishu, and today I'm speaking with Danny of, from Danny Photography, a photographer based out of Northampton, Massachusetts. Now, what's special about Danny is Danny is going to be speaking at Inspire Photo Retreats in January 2015. Oh, is it February? February 2015. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's get those dates right. February 2015. And, you know, I am so inspired by people like Danny who are out there ready to teach other photographers to do things right. So, Danny, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. Danny, I wanted to just jump right in and ask you, I know you've got uh, uh, just a, a robust business out of Northampton. Uh, you, you, do, you work with clients in the boudoir. You work with clients who are uh, getting married. You work the corporate angle, uh, the headshots. I mean, you just do it all. Um, I do <laughs> you are a, you, you, you run a busy business. And clearly, what drives that business is sales, correct? Yeah. Yes. Without sales, there's no business. That's very true. Yeah, right? I feel really passionately about that. Absolutely. Um, what one tip would you give my audience, our audience here at Tiffin Box and Inspire, just to say this is what uh, I'm going to be possibly teaching you guys at Inspire? What is it that one thing that you want to talk about? Sure. Well, um, like you said before, I feel really, really passionately about sales. I feel like as long as you're coming at it from an honest standpoint and you're really selling people things that they want and things that you believe in, um, then it's not like it's, sales doesn't have a, like a bad connotation. It can be really great. You're providing people a service. You're providing them with these images that are going to last a lifetime. And I think as long as you kind of get behind it from that standpoint and you're really honest about it, then sales are a good thing and not a bad thing. I think people think sort of scary used car salesman and sales is sort of like if you're great at sales then you're not a true artist. I think that people kind of have this funny, there's a funny connotation behind sales and I'm going to kind of debunk that and talk about how it's actually a great thing and it's a really positive thing and you're providing a service and, um, and, and sales can be fun. And I think um, one of the things that uh, we're going to talk about a lot at Inspire is how we had a client who called and said that they wanted to spend about $800 on their wedding for photography. Yeah, that's kind of my reaction too. I was like, oh, well, I'm not sure that we can help you. And she's like, no, 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 I want to come in. I just want to have an appointment. And how that $800 client ended up being an over $10,000 wedding package. Um, so we're going to kind of tell stories about how we can really provide a service with educating people on um, how important of an investment photography is. Do you feel that photographers overthink sales? I think they don't give it enough thought. Really? Um, oh, wow. Okay. You know, I think that people, a, a lot of like really, um, there's a lot of really talented photographers out there that maybe aren't charging enough or they're scared to really charge what they're worth because they feel like maybe they won't book enough. Um, so I think, I think sales are just a really scary topic for most people, especially in an artistic field. What would you say uh, is one of the obstacles that photographers place themselves in, you know, in front of uh, when it comes to sales? Like, is, is there something that's, uh, that a photographer typically does time and time again that prevents her or him from getting the sale? Um, I think maybe just not saying the numbers confidently enough. I, we, we were recently hiring for a studio photographer, and one of the questions I always asked them, I said, tell me my total. Tell me my total is like $3,500. And this girl that I was interviewing like literally hold a, held a thing in front of her face, and she was like, um, your total is $3,500. Like she kind of cringed. And I said, okay, well, now ask me to say it. And I was like, well, your total is 3500 and it's a great investment. And I kind of just said it with confidence, and, um, and it just came across really differently. And I think if, if you don't have a problem saying larger numbers, then your, your clients will feel that. And they'll just say, oh, yeah, yeah, okay, so my total is whatever, and it's worth it, and she's going to do a great job. And um, So I think it's kind of a lot in the delivery of how you say a total. Excellent, excellent. Danny, thank you so much for joining uh, me today. I know this is just a little preview of uh, the coming attractions in, in February 2015 when you're going to be expanding on all these things about sales uh, for photographers at the Inspire Photo Retreat. So thank you so much for giving us a little little sneak preview of what, what's, what's to come. Yeah, thank you for talking with me. Take care. Bye. Bye.